And now, we'd like you to have this. The other Wardens and I infused our power into a mighty weapon to aid you in your fight. Returning the Dream Shard to its rightful place is no small victory, but Vermina attacks on several fronts. I kept this quiet, but Azura warned me. There is another omen. Yes, Minevia is secure, but Vermina's dark influence now seeps into the eastern region of Gavadan. Azura's shrine there has been desecrated. It's the Supernal Dreamers again. I'm sure of it. I'm glad you're in this with me. We must stop the Dreamers, and if there is another omen, we must destroy it. I leave now for Shinji's Scarp and Gavadan. I want you there too. But first, I need you to warn High King Emmerich. Welcome back to Wayrest. It's good to see you again. Do you have any news? To be honest, this whole matter with the Dream Shard has robbed me of a few nights' sleep. I'll be a royal grump if we can't get this matter resolved soon. Well, there we go then. That wasn't quite so bad as Abbot Durak made it sound. I'm sure he had his reasons, though. What about the Daedra, the omen that was behind all this? I trust it's dead or gone? In Gavadan? Why couldn't it be in Morrowind or somewhere else across the continent? Gods! We already have enough trouble in Garvedon. General Gardron says the Iron Hand Ogres are far from being fully defeated. Well, that's good, at least. You two are the experts, though I suppose that's a dubious honor. If there is an omen in Garvedon, I'm guessing it's similarly disguised. Gardron didn't report anything suspicious, but maybe it's worth asking Captain Erno. Yes. Ernel was fighting with Gardron, but he's just been reassigned to shore up our defenses here in Wayrest. It may be a wild Guar chase, but it's worth asking Ernel if he saw any signs of Daedric influence in Garbadon. recognize you from the stories. You're the one who helped save Count Atura, aren't you? He's an old friend. I'm glad to make your acquaintance. Don't mind the guillotine. It's just for show. Well, you know as well as anyone else, these supernal dreamers have been trying to recruit people all over Stormhaven. We're hoping this will serve as a deterrent. If we catch a cultist, we'll execute him. Nothing more than that. Really? I heard there was a woman who joined the cult in Alcair and tried to murder her husband. We don't look too kindly on that. You didn't come here to talk about politics, though, did you? Sure enough. I was acting liaison to General Godron out at Shinji Scarp. But he's worried that the ogres might break through and attack Wayrest. Godron suggested to the king that I be assigned to organize defenses here, so here I am. Well, not that I know of. General Godron's been losing sleep, worried about the ogres, but other than that, everyone's been sleeping just fine. Or at least as well as you can expect for a war camp. General Godron is acting a little strange, though. It's not my place to question the general, but he does seem to be blowing the ogre threat out of proportion. That's just my two coppers, though. Good luck if you're headed out to Gavadon. Don't. 
question my orders. Just tell the commander we need more soldiers and more supplies. Yes, General. If you say we need them, then we need them. It's good you're here. The General says the battle does not go as well as he hoped. I told him you could help. I've had little time to search for the Omen. Did you learn anything in Wayrest? Anything about nightmares in Gavadon? The General? If the Omen were to get a hold of him, that would be very bad. Before we act, we must be sure, though. For now, we keep an eye on Gautron. Perhaps helping him defeat the Ogres will flush the Omen out. We need everyone we can get. You're just in time. I need every able-bodied man and woman. You're carrying a weapon, so I assume you're able. You like to fight ogres? It does, and by Moloch we need you. The Iron Hand ogres have stopped us cold out there, and I can't afford to lose any more soldiers. Will you join my clan, Murtaugh clan, in this battle? We've been trying to break through the ogre lines for days. Sergeant Olfen is leading the charge. If you can help him take the tower up on the rocks, we can establish a forward command post. Then we're in striking distance to finish this thing. I brought my army here as a favor to King Emmerich, but Murtaugh clan has other battles to fight. We need to finish the Iron Hand ogres and finish them fast. May your kills be quick and many, soldier. The Iron Hands come from our side of the mountains, from Rothgar. They've plagued our efforts to rebuild Orsinium for years. Murtaugh clan has fought them more times than I can count. That's why King Emric asked us to come to Gavadon's aid. Both. I fought at Emric's side in Rancer's War. We helped drive the Reachmen from Stormhaven, and in exchange, Emric returned Orsinium to Orc hands. That conflict was of mutual benefit. This one isn't. Because it was Bretons who destroyed Orsinium, and now Murtaugh clan must come to their rescue? Maybe. Emric's my friend, and he's High King of the Daggerfall Covenant, but we won't forget Orsinium. Wait until next time. We... that's what we say. Our chieftain is in Rothgar, but I am proud to say I lead Murtaugh clan in battle. Centuries ago, Murtaugh clan was one of the strongest clans in Orsinium. We were nearly destroyed along with the city, but we are resilient. Some of us do, some don't. It will be decades before Orsinium regains its former glory. Many see the city as a reminder of past defeats. Nonetheless, Murtaugh clan works to rebuild it and to defend it from the Iron Hand ogres. Well, that didn't work. Time to come up with a new plan. Again. What went wrong? I'll tell you what went wrong. I was trained to fight ogres, not rocks! We can't even get to the ogres. It's those damn boulders they're throwing. Every time we try to charge across, another one of my soldiers gets smushed! Did he? You can't fly, can you? Sure would make it easier. Failing that, if you're willing to make a run for it, I'll cheer you on. From back here. One tip. Don't run in a straight line. Zigzag. Hide behind the rocks and you just might make it. If you can make the ridge, I bet 50 gold those ogres fall back. Take my warhorn. If you get across, climb the tower and blow the horn. That will signal us to move up and establish a forward command post. Guts and glory, friend! Straighten up. The battlefield's no place to relax. Steel and stone, welcome to the Scarp. We could use your help on the battlefield. Would you join us in the fight for glory? Good, very good. Maybe along the way you would help me make my family proud? 
I want to come back from battle with something to remember it by. Something I can hang on the wall and tell stories about. I want a war trophy. A necklace. A necklace made of ogre teeth with big, wide bands packed with more teeth than you can count. I've got two sacks of them here at the camp, but I need more. The more, the better. Help me, and I'll help you. Ogres may not be the ogres off! Sergeant Olfen's impressed. Says you've got guts and you're fast on your feet. Assuming you can fight, I think we found the hero to finish these ogres off. Ha! Huh. There won't be an attack. I don't have the soldiers to spare. Abbot Durok says you're a champion, though, and I trust him. I believe you can do this on your own. The ogre's leader is called Skull Crusher. He's big, he's mean, and he's nasty, but you can take him. I would send soldiers to help you, but another battle is brewing, and they have to prepare. It's a fight that's long overdue, but it's Clan Murtaugh's fight, not yours. Your fight is with the ogres. I need you to kill Skull Crusher and stop the ogres from coming through the mountain. The Iron Hands have been using a cavern to get through the mountains. I sent a mining team to collapse the cavern, but they never reported back. Find them and help them get it done. After that, we can clean up what's left. I don't understand why the General's holding us back, or what this glorious next battle is that he keeps talking about. It's not my place to question orders either, though. of ogre blood and victory, friend. You have the teeth? Aha, good work. Generations of orcs will admire what you've helped create. I've heard more good news as well. General Godron said there's another battle coming. Bring it on, I say. Please, you have to finish it. We were so close. Just those last three support beams and we'd have caved it in. Boom. No more ogres. There's no one left to help. <clears throat> Just me. And I'm spent. Get through the ogres and you could do it alone, though. A pickaxe to the support beams down there will bring the whole place down. Smash them, and then run for your life. Just down the hill, Shamargro Lorga had one. When we ran, the ogres followed him. I... I heard his screams. 
His pickaxe should be there. I'd give you mine, but it's all I have to defend myself. If the ogres see me, I at least want to go down swinging. did it. I couldn't believe it when I heard the crash, but you brought the whole place down. Almost cost you your life. I searched through the rubble. Was just about to give up. I'm glad I found you, though. After what you did, it was an honor. You shut them down. Our soldiers cleared out the stragglers. No more iron hands. I know General Godron will want to see you. So you survived. I worried you were buried along with the ogres. For collapsing that cavern, you deserve a medal. Unfortunately, though, General Godron's in no condition to hand out awards. I... I don't know. When he heard the cavern collapse, he declared mission accomplished for the Iron Hand ogres. But then he ordered me to muster the troops and prepare to march on Wayrest. I don't understand what happened to the general. But I will say he just hasn't been himself lately. If there's anything I can do to help him, please let me know. They're just upstairs. I know Abbot Durak will be relieved to see you. He said to send you up right away when you return. Whatever's going on, I hope you can help General Godron. He's like a father to me. <clears throat> Bet the Lion Guard could use another strong orc. Maybe I'll head to the Redoubt and offer my services. Praise Azura. I was losing faith. 
You were right about General Godron. The omen of betrayal has the general in its grips. He was going to betray Emmerich and attack Wayrest. This was Vermina's ultimate plan, to destroy the Daggerfall Covenant. It sounds like her omen has been twisting the general's mind, convincing him to betray King Emmerich. I suspected the omen was manipulating events toward that end, but by defeating the ogres, you exposed its plan before it was ready. No. Vermina and her minions still have the general in their grips. You've done this before, so I think you should do it again. We need to get Godron back. Don't question my orders. Just tell the commander we need more soldiers and more supplies. Yes, General. If you say we need them, then we need them. deploy so many against the Iron Hand Ogres. Why do you ask for three regiments? Vengeance. Emmerich, trust me. I can make Wayrus suffer as Orsinium did. Refuse allies, but don't forget who's in charge. Of course, General. After we sack Wayrest and kill the king, you can have the city. We just want the people. Trust me, mortal. I wish your presence in Quagmire. Come to me. You mortals. Always such high aspirations. You dream of interfering with my plans, but it is a fantasy. Do you really think my manipulations would be so vulnerable? You are not even a hindrance. You can. There's nothing you can do now. The omens were a distraction. A daydream. Now the real nightmare begins. You see? You protected your general. But you sacrificed your king. Once again, you return safely from the dream, bringing one of Vermina's victims back with you. General Gartron seems to be feeling himself again. King Emmerich? That... that is bad. We just received word that the King has fallen ill. It cannot be a coincidence. Vermina is raising the stakes. She makes a final bid for power by assaulting our King. King Emmerich falling ill cannot be a coincidence. Vermina is raising the stakes, making a final bid for power by assaulting the king himself. I am out of my league. I will go to the king's side, but we must seek Azura's help. You must go to Azura's shrine at the Weeping Giant. 
It has been defiled, and I fear the supernal dreamers are involved. Regardless, the shrine must be cleansed. That is certain. To cleanse the shrine, you need to get glow dust from the wisps on the eastern shore. That and the rare mineral azurite from the northern hills. Cleanse the shrine and pray for Azura's guidance. She will send it. I pledge my life to helping King Emmerich and to destroying anything, anyone, associated with Vermina.